What's going on, everybody? Head back with Silver Sport, and we got Chuck on the line. Hey, everybody. What do you say? What do you know? It's the finish line. 12th. Day 12. Yeah. Day 12. And Prism Megabox uh, is the final I, I thought it was an exciting milestone moment. You're just like, yeah, day 12. Day 12. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, three silvers. There's a Prism Mega Box, two Mega Box exclusive Neon Pulsar Prisms, uh, and then you know the cop out for Panini one memorabilia card. This used to be one auto or something, right? Or at least a chance. Uh, so day twelve, Prism Mega Box for the today's winner. You will have only a short time to get into this one uh, because this video will re re release on Friday, and Saturday is the live giveaway at eleven Pacific time, eleven a.m. Pacific time, uh, live. So, make sure you, one central, two yeah. Eastern. Yeah. So you'll jump in once we figure out whatever the code word is. Again, uh, simple to enter. Like, like the video. Subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below with whatever code word we come up with today. Uh, yeah. So Chronicles. I bought this on Black Friday. I think you can find it for about three hundred bucks. I think that's what I paid for it. Uh, 2021 Chronicles, still hunting for Justin Fields, although if he is in here, he's probably a redemption. Oh, uh, so how much you want for the Bears in this box? Uh, I don't think I'm selling the Bears in this box. The whole reason I'm buying it is hunting for Justin Fields. So, <laughs> I'll, I'll sell you the bucks or something if you want, right? Like, <laughs> uh, How about Khalil Herbert? Will you sell me Khalil Herbert? I'll sell you Khalil Herbert. One dollar! One dollar! Wait a minute, that don't really... I don't get up in the morning for one dollar, Chuck. I don't know... I don't know. One dollar and one penny. Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, oh, come on, man. <laughs> it's Christmas. All right, all right, all right. Done deal. Khalil Herbert. Two autographs and one memorabilia card. Uh, and Chuck gets Khalil Herbert as a Christmas gift. Oh! Look at there. He didn't even cheap ass if, Chuck. If I go hit list, do you buy me something else? He saved it. <laughs> <laughs> That's some typical stuff for Chuck to pull, yeah. Um, you, couldn't have, you couldn't have done that off the cuff any better, Chuck. Uh, two autographs and one memorabilia card. Six cards per box, eight packs. We have pulled, now in 2020, we pulled some fire Justin Herbert out of here. Matter of fact, I still got that card around here somewhere. Uh, I think it was a score update. Chronicles is always nice. Uh, but, hey, but if you do hit a Travis ATN autograph, I, I'm... You're going to have to try to make a deal with it on me because oh. I still ain't bought one of those for my kids. Oh, yeah, you're in the market, huh? Still, yeah. Well, I mean, I'm kind of in the market, but it's it's Travis ATN. He hasn't really shown anything, but people still want like 80 bucks for an autograph. I'm like, I'll give you 15 bucks for it. Yeah. Oh, and there it is. And there it is, the first hit, Batman, uh, 333 out of 399 on the, I'm sure it's not specific, Correct, not from any specific game or event. Uh, I'm kind of to the point where, like, you could just stop putting mem cards in boxes if they're not from any specific game or event. Like, what's the point anymore? What do you What do you think about that? Down a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm not seeing the. Oh. There you go. Yeah. Now, hey, look at that. I just, I just don't see the purpose in mem cards that aren't actually memorabilia uh, related to the player. So, just me, right? Nico Collins. Here's a rookie. Let me get this stuff out. Let me separate my stuff here. Rashad Bateman again. Oh, there's a Luminance update. Felipe Franks for the Falcons. Prism Black, Kenneth Gainwell. I like that Prism Black cards. Yeah, me too. I'm a big fan. And then uh, I, I like them actually better than the Prism. The regular <laughs> Prism, right? Kadarius Tony on the Acetate. Uh, yeah. Six packs, man, for 300 bucks. 50 bucks a pack. And what do you think is in here worth $300 that I'm going to pull, Chuck? What do you think? Uh, I don't know. Redemption for $300? How about Flipper Anderson? Oh, there Invincible you go. Invincible autographs. Flipper Anderson for the Rams. I have never Did seen... Did you get a Flipper Anderson? I don't think I've ever seen this, this card before. That is numbered 43 out of 50 for oh. the Rams. Flipper Anderson is going to be our first autograph. And we already pulled it in the second box. Flipper Anderson for the Rams, Chuck. 
Asante Samuel. Oh, Justin Fields. Oldsboro High School in Southern New Jersey. Oh, Kyle Pitts, Jamar Chase, and Josh Allen on the acetate. What kind of autograph? What's the name of that set? Invincible Autographs. Invincible? Yeah. And he just signs his name Flipper. Yeah. Aaron Rodgers. Oh, where's my stacks at here? Taylor Heineke. There you go. MVP. There's a legacy update. Chuba Hubbard, rookie. Kyle Pitts. Uh, flipping it around. Dwayne Eskridge. Oh, we got something here. Kyle Pitts on the flux. That looks like it's going to be numbered. And it is 65 out of 75 on the Kyle Pitts flux orange. Oh. And there's a regular. Where's Cleo Herbert? Terrace Marshall and a Pat Fryer move. Uh, good question, Chuck. Good question. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, okay. So here you go. I mean, if you're seeing these boxes on sale, you probably searched out this video just for this very purpose to see if it's worth buying. So we'll see. <laughs> Uh, TJ Hawkinson. What do we got in here? Eli, Eli Mitchell. Elijah. Kadarius Tony. Joe Mixon on the numbered parallel to $3.99. And Cool over. Yeah. And a Jamar Chase on the shimmy shiny score update. Not numbered. And Chuba Hubbard on the acetate. Two packs to go. We're running out of packs here, my friend. Yeah, did you find anything out about Flipper Anderson? Well, just what you already said. Oh, okay. Land I what I already said out of uh, Paulsboro High School in Southern New Jersey. Oh. Second round pick of the 88 draft. Oh. 257 catches, 5,357 yards, and 28 NFL touchdowns. Oh. There's a prism black silver, but it's Terrace Marshall. Uh, those could be hot uh, if you get the right player in those silvers. Kyle Trask. Ian. Anderson currently lives in Suwanee, Georgia, and is a high school basketball referee. Oh. His son, Dre, plays wide receiver for the Utah Utes. So so his stats didn't sound too crazy. How, how did he get an invincible autograph? Do we Have we drawn that conclusion, or am I just missing it? Um, on January 7th, 1990, during a divisional playoff game, the Rams won the coin toss after taking the New York Giants to overtime. The Rams drove 77 yards in four plays, the last being a 30-yard touchdown pass to Anderson, who caught the ball in the end zone and ran directly through the tunnel and into the locker room. Okay. I, I, mean, I mean, he's not a Hall of Famer, right? No, no. He does have the record for most yards receiving in a game at 336. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, I guess there, that's it. Oh, and here we go. Jets, Jets, Jets. Yeah! Zach Wilson on the autograph. Yeah! 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 Oh, but that's a prism black silver Zach Wilson. Uh, oh, good thing he didn't kick the bed this year. Oh, wait a minute. That would have been fire last year, right? That would have probably been a $500 card uh, plus uh when this box came out that's actually a good box and i'm not upset i mean i get it zach wilson's looked a little rough but kid's got a ton of talent and i still hold out hope that he can figure it out right it's just it's just being young right now that's his problem right uh making bad decisions which young people do but that is nice zach wilson on the prism black silver auto that saved that box uh oh, it's not numbered? no it's not numbered the silver ones aren't numbered, I don't think. Uh, we will take that. That is not bad at all, man. Uh, if that would have been Justin Fields, I might have lost my mind right here. <laughs> uh, but the problem is it wouldn't have had an autograph. It would have been a redemption, and I'd still be waiting on it like I am all my other Justin Fields. Uh, one sold today with 17 bids for $53. Yeah, I won't sell it for that. I'll just keep it, right? I don't. I, I, that's a nice hold right there. I don't think I'm holding any other Zach Wilsons, but... Uh, I do have one or two on eBay that I'm kind of holding because I haven't dropped the price, right? So, which I never do on any of my cards because I'm too lazy. Uh, Pat <laughs> Fryermuth out of 49. Uh, yeah, it's not for not for lack of, it's just because I'm too lazy to go do it, right? Like, uh, I don't have the time. Pat Fryermuth, 
that's is that a luminance? That's a luminance update out of 49. That's a nice one. We pulled a lot of Pat Fire move. There's a nice prism black. Jalen Waddle. Followed by an Anthony Schwartz. Oh, so is my is my hit list prize uh a Zach Wilson autograph? Oh uh, no, Chuck, no. <laughs> no, no, it's not. Uh did we, for Anderson. <laughs> did we figure out what the code word was? Oh no, it's just Merry Christmas, man. Wish somebody a Merry Christmas. Enjoy it. Spread the holiday cheer. You know, if you add into Christmas, happy holidays, whatever. Just say something nice. Be nice to people. Be nice to people. I like it, Chuck. Well done. Uh, even Anthony Schwartz. <laughs> I like so. Uh, but yeah. Except Simi Fohoko. Almost Christmas time, yeah. So uh, just, you know, drop a comment below wishing everybody a Merry Christmas or whoever. And uh, we will. Happy holidays, all that stuff. Yeah, or whatever. Yeah, whatever whatever term you, you prefer. Uh, it is that time of year. Uh, anyway. Tomorrow is the live. Uh, this video will go out on Friday. So tomorrow is the live, 11 a.m. Pacific time. Uh, join us if you can. If, Mountain. And Yeah, join us if you can. And if you can't... One Central. That's okay, too. Uh, we will... You'll, you'll still Two be Eastern. Able, you'll still be able to win if you were in any of those videos. Uh, and we will either... If you're in the live, we'll, we'll rip it if you want to. Or we'll just ship you the box so you can uh, enjoy ripping your own box at home. Uh, or pack, whatever it was. Uh, but yeah, thanks everybody for watching all through the Chris Christmas holiday, uh, 12 days of Christmas stuff. And is this our third annual? It is our third annual, Chuck. You are correct. Holy cow. Third annual, 12 days of Christmas. Uh, I didn't think we'd be doing this nonsense for three weeks, let alone three years. And I think the prizes get a little bit bigger each year. So hopefully next year we got even more good stuff. That'd be cool. Yeah. So... There we go. Thanks again. Wait, wait, wait. That means we're going to do this for another year? Oh, <laughs> I think so. You so. I think so. Holding up shop here on the New Year's Eve was the big announcement program. Oh, was it, Chuck? Are you are, are you are you wore out, Chuck? Are you wore out? <laughs> I'm spent. I'm spent. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Merry Christmas to all of you and your families. I hope you enjoy your holiday break. If you can make the live, we'll see you then. If not, we'll see you next time. Thanks, everybody, and Merry Christmas. And we're out.